Hey there, it's Plum. Welcome back to Sokopi's Ears. Last we left off, I suck at riddles. Whatever. But anyway, we're here in the Death's Passage looking for Stella. Here lies the Shep Marsh. The text is already evaporating. Evaporating? Huh. What a pity. Barrel. Nothing about you, Barrel. Okay, okay. Another message. Let me see. Don't push me. Will that open the door? Don't push. I don't know how it'll realize we left it alone. Uh. Wait a second. That's a trap for dumb explorers. You sure? Okay. Watch me be the dumb one. <sighs> Regardless, we'll push it. It said not to push it! Well, we already tried not pushing it, Adlin. What else what else do we have left to try? <laughs> right, tiny fire. Ugh. Good. Hi. Oof. Okay. Yeah. Ooh. Well, look that opened the door. I don't understand this one. Well, to make you happier, me neither. <laughs> Good job, Melvin. Good job. Well, I can tell we're going to be doing a lot of. We're gonna be having a lot of near-death situations, so... Uh, okay. Because I want to wait... Just a little. Good. I had to open the door, I had to press it either way. Stella? What a weird statue. It looks like... a fairy. Yes, you are correct, Malvin. Eh? Stella, don't scare me like that! How did you make contact again? Didn't it break when we were out in the open? It is true, my telepathy was too weak to maintain a normal conversation from such a distance. But we can hear you clearly here, deep underground. The answer is simple. You are standing before me. No kidding. What? You're the statue? Yes. I am a victim of a curse, just like the entirety of Fora Marsh. Ooh, progress. Plot progress. Even we are? Dark energy. The source of a curse? It starts to make sense. What makes sense? What dark energy? Uh, right. When I picked you up from the priest, he mentioned you had a big clump of some dark power in your head. But you said nothing. I didn't want to worry you. Just yesterday you were supposed to be executed, and now this? I had no idea how you would react. The priest also said everyone had this energy inside. Even me. And the amounts we have... Not the amounts we have, but still. I want to take care of this later. I'm sorry to interrupt your confession, Malvin, but we should work on removing that said curse, starting from the three of us. Okay, but what is that curse anyway? You were turned into stone. And everyone else had their memories altered more or less heavily. Who would have done that? As far as my knowledge goes, it was Cygnus. Of course it was the super shady brother, oh my gosh! Or whatever remains of him. My, my brother? That's impossible. Really? Really? That's impossible. He's a shepherd. 
We have no control over dark energy like that. Well, if you think back to the equilibrium rule, doesn't that actually mean like when you do use faith power, it turns into negativity? Eh, maybe I just don't understand it that well. You are correct with everything but one statement. Cygnus is not your brother. What? Ooh. Well, that makes sense for for me to feel attached to him. It could alter my memories. But why would he? Do not worry. Once we lift the curse, you will have no problems with doing what we have to. You mean... Killing him? Yes, sadly, it is necessary in order to return peace to Foramarsh. I'm down for that. <laughs> okay. How do we lift the curse? I can do all the purifying, but you need to break my curse of stone. To do that... You need to bring me a crystal with the essence of my soul. Essence of your soul, okay. You mean... This stone? I am truly amazed. You, are, you already defeated the Bell Belly Guardian and acquired my soul stone. Please, place it on the pedestal. Okay! Oh, oh, that's just gonna talk to me. Oops! Place the stone on my pedestal. Also, the letter I gave you it will be helpful for me. Thanks, you. <laughs> Life truly is a treasure. It... it worked! You have a scary face, Stella. I do not recall you being so honest, Malvin. I thought Adeline was. M me Do we meet before? Ah, uh, how careless of me. I did not return your memories yet. Our memories. Do we really need to go through this? I see no other option. I need to remove the dark energy from you. This will cause all of Boromarsh to remember the truth. Scary face. It's not that awful. It's okay. Without it, Cygnus will be too powerful. Cygnus. If that's so, then begin. With the power given by the Shepherd of the Old, I, Stella, cleanse your souls from all the darkness. Cygnus attacked us. He killed Valentine. The only person we could ever call mother. He took control. Brainwashed everyone. Do not worry, it can be hard to handle all those rushing memories. Take your time. Ugh. Mere seconds ago, I thought I wouldn't be able to rise my hand against him. Now I can't stop the urge to do so. I understand your feelings, but you must not let them violate your decisions. But Stella, do we really have a chance to defeat Cygnus? You got us once already. I... My, do not fear him. Perhaps Valentine did pass away, but I am sure her spirit is caring for you. Still, he will be a tough one to defeat. We struggled against Bell Belly. Well, it wasn't that bad. And it was only powered up by him. Oh! Okay. Well, this should be interesting. How much time do we have before Cygnus comes here? I'm positive he felt some changes by now. I cannot give us more than one day. We should rest before tomorrow. I'm not sure how everything will turn out, but you will be with me. Right, sister? Yes, brother. I will follow you to the end of the world. More cutscenes incoming! Save game! Yes! Wait a second. Does that mean... Oh, heck no, I better not mean it. Oh, okay. Okay, it's, it's not as bad as I thought it was gonna be. So, you're staying here? You're going to stay here? Yes, I am. It will take some time before people will recover their memories, so my presence could cause unwanted confusion. Will you be safe here? Sidness could target you. I can handle myself, Adlin. Do not worry about me. 
one thing still bothers me. How are we supposed to defeat Cygnus? I am not sure... What? I am not sure. What do you mean? Well, neither of us can't. Neither of us can't. Uh, grammatical stuff. Sorry, whatever. How do we defeat another shepherd with such ability? Oh my, I am terribly sorry. I completely forgot about such important details. Then what should we do? Oh! It better not be him, I swear. If it's him, mm. uh, I don't know who you are. You can just let me finish my job. Ah, oh, no! It's him! Ugh! What kind of a voice should I give this guy? Ugh. I am not... <sighs> you do not know. It's been so long since I've felt this way towards an unknown character in a video game. Oh my gosh. Cygnus! You're here already. Oh my gosh. <laughs> what kind of voice should I give this dude? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. <sighs> you were hoping that I wouldn't notice a shift in power? Fools! Malvin, I gave you a chance. I spared your life for your obedience. But you decided to betray me. Obedience? You mean enslavement? You brainwashed me and wanted to use me for your own advantages. You are not worthy of being a shepherd. You're such- you're much more of a monster. We, we won't let such monsters exist in our nation. Such high words for children like you. I should have just killed you when I first had the chance. Malvin, Adam, I am sorry, but I cannot assist you in battle. Don't worry, we'll handle him. So you decided to side with that fairy, and you know she isn't the evil one here. Well, I mean, you kind of gave it away from your previous dialogue. Perhaps you're right, but I could have made my choice already. You never were my brother. You are my enemy. Be gone! <laughs> ha! Those are your attacks? It's not even tickling me. I'll help you. I'll show you what a real attack is. Oh, heck! What? What kind of an attack is this even? That's not powered by faith. It's using the activity. How? You thought you had a chance against me? Ha! You're so naive! I feel generous today. I'll spare you the pain of death by finishing you with one strike! No! <laughs> oh. Uh. I gave you a chance, and you failed me. No. Yes! Ugh. What is this place? Addy? It's super dark here. Okay, it's getting spooky here. Thanks, you. Don't give up. Who's there? Don't leave us. Is this where dead people end? I died, right? Can I rest in peace, please? Only special ones in here, Malvi. Calm down. Special ones? Where are you? Who are you? How do you know me? You always had so many questions, Malvi. I'm Valentine. You remember me, right? Valentine? Mommy? I love when you call me like that. Oh my gosh. Sorry, sorry. That just kind of... Mm. Where are you? Show yourself, please! I no longer have a physical form. I am one with faith energy now. One with faith? Addy? Adlin? What's going on here? You are balancing between life and death. You may choose if you want to continue, to fight Cygnus again, or to simply give up. A 
That's a tough one. I don't know if we can defeat Cygnus. It doesn't matter if you can defeat him. What truly matters is if you will fight him. This doesn't make sense. Don't you hear these voices? These are the prayers of people who wish to have your protection. The people who want to live peacefully. You know only you can bring this peace. Malvi, whatever you choose, I'll follow you. Always. No, this better not be like one of those other choices like before. <sighs> okay, I get it now. Can we get back to living? I'm tired of this place. Good luck living here, Mom. I knew you'd choose well. Thank you for choosing it. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I knew you'd choose well. You're my brother after all. Good. Now change the world like you always wanted. Yes, boy! Oh my gosh, yes! Your presence here is unwanted. Leave now, and we may forgive your actions against Formarsh. I'll leave. Before I go, I have one last insect to squash. Combat is not my strongest asset, but I am not defenseless. Oh my gosh! Was... <laughs> oh my gosh! Stop flailing around, you're only delaying the inevitable! I was created to support the shepherds of Foramarsh. You've already failed! Twice! You can't stop me now. Nobody can! Don't praise a day. Before sunset. What? You're still alive! Dying is quite boring. Too bad it's your turn now. I mean, I, I already had millions of assassins trying to kill me earlier, so I can't let you have this one. Do you think I'll surrender just because you survived my killing blow? You won't. You don't care anyway. Maybe you are stronger than us. Maybe we won't ever defeat you. But as long as we live, We'll fight you, and we won't stop, till we free Foramarsh from you. As long as you live, this will be a very short time then. Oh! Gosh! Resist! Good! What? This barrier. It's from pure faith energy. It's... so warm. Malvin, Adlin, it's your chance. Use the faith energy to gain power worthy of true shepherds. No, I won't allow it. Oh. oh, yes! No, this can't be. I made sure you'd never be able to transform. The new shepherds of Far Marsh awaken. Got me go. I pray I said that right. <laughs> Keeper of wisdom and Astia, the guardian of truth. Oh, it's even cuter than the bar, oh! Cygnus, your rule ends now. If you are to surrender now, we will end this without any bloodshed. Surrender? I die I'd rather die than let you imprison me. Imprison you? You wanted to free you. But if you don't want to. Choose before we do. Never! Ugh! This is your strength. It is. Consider yourself lucky for being its first victim. Yes, I can finally see your true potential. The strength soon to be my own. Something tells me this isn't going to end well. <coughs> of course it won't. Not for you! Oh! Oh! So this is your true face. I have to admit, you are quite ugly. Whatever remains of him. So this is what you meant, Stella. Cygnus was dead all this time. I'm hungry for the power of a young shepherd. I will consume your power. You could have indigestion if you do this. I warned you. You seek power, do you? We will show you our power. Prepare to meet your end. Oh yes! Oh yes! Yes, 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 yes! Yes! And this is only chapter one, supposedly! Ha 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 ha! Alright, Thunder Danger! Focus! Yes! 
Okay. Yes. Ugh. Okay. No, we're gonna try to poison the dude. Don't tell me he's resistant. Ay! It's okay. Take care of your sister. Good. Oh, good, he's confused. Thank you. I poison you again. Yes! He's poisoned! Good, 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 good. Yes! Good, 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 good. Ugh. Okay. Ugh. Essence flux. Folly. Good. No. No. Okay, guys, we're almost there. We're really close. Okay. Good thing you're poisoned, man. Good. Work on your sister now. Aye. Yeah, that's right. Okay. Okay. And... Bolly. Good. Good, you're confused. Wait, was he cured of poisoning? I don't know. Alright, final blow. Yes! Shadow dies! Again? Question mark? Salmon's party won! No. How? How are you that powerful? You're freshlings! You don't under understand an inch of your true power! Shepherds change every 400 years. Each generation is stronger than the last. Even if you could defeat four old shepherds at once, you can't beat a new one. Or was it three? It's not over yet. I will return stronger. I will consume your power! It's over. It's the sickness we knew. It's just an illusion of the real person. Not exactly, Adlin. Or should I say, Ostia? No, it's okay. Use our normal names. This shadow fought Cygnus. Aw, man! Defeated him and possessed his body, slowly killing Cygnus. The shadow had full control over his new vessel, but Cygnus was still inside, fighting and giving ideas to the shadow. He told the shadow about the strength of the new shepherd generation because Cygnus knew that the shadow wanted power. Cygnus was his hope for us to be able to defeat the shadow and free his spirit. That's why he didn't kill us straight away. How do you know all that? I had time to collect my thoughts when I was a statue. Well, I am the keeper of wisdom for a reason, am I not? <laughs> we should head to the city now. We have a lot of work on our shoulders. <gasps> no, I was right! <laughs> oh, man. Thank you for playing this demo. <gasps> oh my gosh. Like, 11 out of 10, no, 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 12 out of 10, dude, this, this game, <laughs> amazing, I, I love this, I have not seen, like, like, a, a JRPG game, oh, look at, look at, yeah, something, wow, this is really, mm, I love this so much, ugh. Because I like how it was all casual in the beginning, and you were just kind of doing your job as a shepherd, and then it kind of led up to this. This was... Good. This this is a great demo. I cannot wait until the, the update comes out. I, I pray it is soon. I heard that chapter two was finished, so I will... I heard that there's, um... 
actually a couple of script changes and stuff. And yeah, so I think I'll probably play this all over again from the beginning, which which I'm down for because if this was the first the first run through, I can't wait to see what comes up in the updates. So overall great game. Good job, Diacon. And this is a, this is this is this is a jewel of a game, I swear. So yeah, I'm looking forward to updates and I I wish this wasn't done so soon, but for a demo this is really really good. So yeah, I don't know what I'm going to be playing next because honestly I missed the Hitalia anniversary on July 6th, and I was debating whether I was going to play this game or something else, but I'm glad I chose this one. So, uh, the next game I'll be playing is probably gonna be a heads of game, and probably gonna be horror, because, I mean, I haven't done horror yet, and I have not done one in a long time, so... May as well see me get spooked and, uh, watch me get scared. <laughs> So, uh, yeah, I look forward to that, so... I cannot get over how great this game is, so, uh, see you in the next playthrough, guys. Peace.